Hi, I'm Sarah Borders with Benefits Compliance Solutions. Recently, the IRS came out with proposed regulations regarding a number of things, but specifically they talked about DPC, or direct primary care, and I wanted to do a quick video to explain what these proposed rules are actually saying. What these proposed regulations did say was that DPC could be reimbursed by an HRA, so Health Reimbursement Arrangement, under Code 213D. However, the rules are silent on whether an FSA could also reimburse those expenses because, generally speaking, FSAs cannot reimburse medical insurance premiums. Also, what it didn't do, what these rules did not do, was say that DPC is no longer considered disqualifying coverage. And remember that disqualifying coverage is coverage that would make someone ineligible to continue contributing to their health savings account throughout the year. So for example, if I was enrolled in some kind of DPC program and I wanted to continue contributing to the HSA, I could no longer do that. And the rules specifically say that. So also these did not mention anything about ERISA and these being considered part of the group health plan or a group health plan, but in the way that they normally function, especially if the employer pays for it, they typically are that way. Also, just keep in mind that these are proposed rules and that the final rules will come out following subsequent comments, which are due in August of this year. So I'm gonna write some more about DPC and what these proposed regulations are saying in my blog. Let me know if you have any questions. Thanks so much. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow us on social media. We'll see you next time.